Just wait till my little bitch David Gockstein starts hosting 24-7 pork spaces. Cope harder. Pork harder. And just like that, pork crosses 300 million market cap in less than 72 hours. The war against Pepe coin has only really just begun. And what's going to be happening to Pepe coin and Pepe fork in the future? This is Meme Coin Max, and I watch the charts so you don't have to. Now, before I begin today's video, guys, make sure you smash that subscribe button and also like this video. So a lot has been transpiring with Pepe coin recently, especially with the new edition of the Pepe fork called Pork. A lot of people have been calling it the Pepe killer, but I, I think it's a nice addition to things. I think that both of these tokens can actually coexist, believe it or not. Yes, I'm not going to invest myself in that really weird and cringy divide that a lot of crypto investors have. Let's be honest here, guys. We're all here for the exact same same reason. Looking at the latest inception of Pepe Fork, we can see that from January 30th up until now, it has been going up so steadily ever since. It doesn't look like it's going to be stopping anytime soon. Obviously, there is probably going to be a sell-off. If I were to predict when that sell-off would happen, I would say maybe when it gets to around the 9,000 mark. Once the once one of these zeros is about to get deleted, I think we're going to see a lot of corrections happen. There's probably going to be a lot of FUD for Pepe Fork. There already is currently. A lot of people actually don't really agree with Pepe Fork even existing. Some people say that it's not going to work. Other people say that it's just an outright scam made by Polly. I don't really think that Pepe Fork is a scam, uh, and I just want to reiterate that Pepe Fork exists because they they don't agree with what the devs have done. The devs have been unloyal to the community. They've stolen from the community treasury. Some arguments as well saying that the Pepe Coin devs should have given some money to Matt Fury. Also agree with that. I think that maybe for using his property, even though he legally they legally don't have to, but they could have given Matt Fury a bit of a kickback on it. Apparently they didn't give any. So these are sort of the things that are pitting Pepe Fork against Pepe Coin right now, with Polly sort of leading the army against Pepe Coin, mostly telling people that this coin is gonna get flipped by Pepe Fork pretty soon. If you guys go on Twitter right now and follow Polly or any of the people that are big fans of Polly, you guys will see nonstop piggies. Most of them are pink, but this one is obviously adorned in a beautiful Matrix outfit. It's sort of asking you, would you like to take the blue pill or would you like to take the green pill? The blue pill will bring you to Pepe Fork, but the green pill will bring you back to Pepe Coin. Which one are you going to choose? I don't really believe in this divide. Honestly, I'm just going to say that right now. And I'm going to be honest with you guys. I actually hold both. I hold both. I'm not going to be selling my Pepe coin. And I don't think I'm going to be selling Pepe Fork. Obviously, this is not financial advice. And I'm not a financial advisor. I just grabbed a small bag. So I decided to sort of test the waters. And I don't mind sort of throwing that sort of money out there. As you guys can see, the price is going up steadily. Um, so I am in good profits right now with it but here's the thing guys with a lot of these people that are promoting Pepe fork that are saying you know Pepe coin is done for i don't agree with that i don't think Pepe coin is done for i don't think it ever will be done for i do think that this has definitely hurt Pepe coin's integrity though i do believe that Pepe coin will make a recovery i think that some things need to happen behind the scenes in order for things to change in a positive note but i don't think that Pepe coin is done for you guys know on this channel that I do a lot of pay Bitcoin content, mostly because the algorithm definitely loves it. I'm also just a huge fan of what Pepe represents, so I like doing these videos about the Pepe coins and the different ones that exist. I'm also just here to share the news, and honestly, I like to do that in the most unbiased way possible, and that's by reviewing all of these tokens and sort of giving them the benefit of the doubt every time. However, I do think that the devs for Pepe coin, there is some shady stuff going around, and I can't really deny that. I'm not going to turn a blind eye to that sort of thing. It definitely does exist. And this is why Pepe Fork exists. Pepe Fork would not exist if the Pepe Coin devs were not shady. I mean, I think we can all agree with that, right? 
In addition to all these memes that I'm showing you guys and all the commotion that's been happening with Pork and Pepe Coin and even Polly, I think I'm going to do a deep dive on Polly. Actually, I'm gonna do a deep dive on him. Uh, I know a lot of people in the crypto space either love him or hate him. It turns out that I don't necessarily hate him. I don't have any. I don't wish any ill will upon him. Like I've said before in a few previous streams and a few previous videos, he may be rough around the edges. He might be a little bit brash. He might be very bold when it comes to stating what he thinks is right and what he thinks is wrong. I'm not necessarily a huge fan of Polly, but I respect the presence that he brings, even though some people might find it obnoxious. And let's be real, the man photoshops his face on so many different posts and so many memes. He's quite the character. So yeah, expect a Polly deep dive video in the near, near future. Pork is 19% away from flipping Pepe. And then underneath you can see here, Polly says that I believe that Pork will flip Pepe today. It won't even take a full 72 hours from launch. I will say this, I do think that there will be some hype that will die down with Pork. I don't think that this hype is going to last forever. I think things are eventually gonna die down. There's gonna be corrections. The hype is gonna die down. I think for the time being though, it's fun to sort of have another Pepe coin in existence. I just don't think that it's going to be super, super long term. But who's to say though, because anything can happen in this space. But what do you guys think? Do you guys think that Pepe Fork could actually really take over the game and become the main Pepe coin that everyone knows? Or do you guys think that this is just a passing fancy and that eventually Pepe Fork will die off and slowly drift into obscurity? Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. And don't forget, guys, you can find me on X here at MemeCoinMax. Come and give me a follow. My follower count is very low, but I appreciate all 107 of you, but I'm definitely looking to grow this community, so make sure you give me a follow if you enjoy my content. This is MemeCoinMax, and I watch the charts so you don't have to.